Hi, I'm Amy Dunker at Clark University. Welcome to Trumpet Quick Lessons. This is the Arban, page 213, uh, Romeo by Bellini. This is a beautiful little aria. Uh, starts out at a moderato, which is a quarter equals 92. Is kind of like how I like to play it. Um, there's a few things to watch out for. The number one thing is making sure that it doesn't swing, that you have the dotted A 16th pattern right. So the best way to do that is to do this little exercise. <laughs> Make sure you get those nice and even. Make sure you're getting third valve slide out. Make sure the downbeat of the first full measure is a long note. The temptation is going to be to play that short like you do the, uh, the two eighth notes. The two eighth notes, make sure you're leaving them open. Hear how the ends are open as opposed to. So you want to watch out for that, making sure they're nice and da, da, because it's more of an orchestral way of playing and it's cleaner and it sounds better in, in the style that we're in. Um, next thing to look out for. Um, make sure the staccatos, the difference between the staccatos and the accents and the non-accented notes. Uh, if you look at the third full measure going to the fourth full measure. Make sure those are, are really exacting and, and differentiated. Make sure they're different. Uh, line two, make sure you do the retardando and get into the odd tempo. Uh, line four, measure the first measure versus the third measure. Look at the articulation. It's a little different. Um, in the first measure, you have your slurring to the 16th and then slurring to. In the third measure, you're slurring and then tonguing two of them. So make sure you make the difference between those. Okay, so make sure you're not holding on to that too long. The first time through, I would tongue it, tongue the tie. too long um, and then really put some crescendo and decrescendo in there and make some beautiful musical lines and go for the best absolute best sound you can get <laughs> 